<laughs> it's so great. God, I love technology when it works. <laughs> This is so hot. <laughs> Pardon me while I was smoke. Water, guys, there isn't even any whiskey in it yet. What's the point? <laughs> so. Yay, here we are. All right. We made it work. <laughs> we've got a little bit. We've got a little bit of lag on the audio, just so that you know there's a wee bit of a latency thing going on, but it's it's not major, like two, three seconds. All right, cool. So are we, are we good? Uh, yeah. Shall I go grab yeah. it? Yeah. Right. Okay. All right. I think. that one is there. <laughs> A little audio outage there. Cool. Dice? Uh, yes, we totally can. No, we can't. <laughs> Dice Ho. Okay. Welcome to the universe's first Young Wizards convention. So great. I uh, I am I'm so delighted. We the entire staff are so just delighted that this is a thing that is happening. There are people who came from other places <laughs> to sit in this room, and those people are you. <laughs> like that's. Ah, I, uh, yesterday I thought it was real, and it is not. Today it is real, and that's, that's I, I need a moment. Uh, so, so uh, it is the first year of the convention, which means uh, we should talk a little bit about how we got here. Um, I thought that the first date that was important to us, and the first date that we have that is important to us is June 6, 2013. Mm -hmm. um, but right before we get to that, um, I think a number of you uh, are on a Young Wizards fan directory that was made on a Tumblr post um, by Sarah, who is somewhere right over there, over there. <laughs> not sitting down, it tricked me, um, <laughs> who then put everybody on a map um, and ask her later about Canada. We're not going to talk about that right now. <laughs> but, um, put everybody on a map and we all looked at it and we kind of went, none of us lives near any of the rest of us. <laughs> well, that was disappointing. Um, and then a Tumblr user named Shamrock Jones okay. <laughs> uh, wrote, I've always thought the collective of cousins should all meet up at a convention someday, actually. It seems like the most workable plan. A couple of people, uh, including myself, put out some stuff that said, actually, we've been thinking about this idea. Uh, how about we call it WizCon? That's a horrendous name. <laughs> um, and I started getting asks from people who said, I could help with this thing. Um, can I be on staff? And I was like, there isn't a staff yet. <laughs> now, now there is. Um, so, 
That was June 2013. In February 2014, we became, we became a real live company. And then uh, we put on an Indiegogo at the end of that year, which uh, many of you supported us with. And thank you so, so much for that. Um, we wanted to get to $6,000, and we got to $10,000. And that is That's the result. I, I remember exactly where I was when that happened. Um, uh, I was sitting with a friend of mine, uh, and I was checking my phone, which is super out of character for me. Um, and he's like, what are you doing? And I'm like, I'm refreshing. Uh, $10,000. And I was like, I have to make a Tumblr post. And he's like, you are eating ribs. <laughs> Tumblr is more important than ribs right now. Uh, and How? How is that? <laughs> so ribs are important. <laughs> getting heckled by herself. <laughs> um, so then we looked for a hotel somewhere that we could make sure that the most number of people could get here. And I remember another conversation we were setting up Eventbrite and we said, well, should we like, should we figure out if we need to cap the con? Um, and then I was like, yeah, that's a problem that we'll figure out when we get there. <laughs> so needless to say, we have learned a lot and we have organized a lot. There is a ton of fun stuff in store. Uh, we're gonna talk about that a little bit later on, but to begin with, I want to introduce our guests of honor for the convention. Uh, let us start with Diane Duane. <laughs> Thank you guys. Okay, yeah, I got it. <laughs> oh. um, we also are delighted to have Sean and McGuire here. And I think uh, a number of us are uh, really looking forward to seeing Mark Oshiro. <laughs> Um, so, and then I, I want to take a moment, I admit it's a bit of a self-indulgent moment, but uh, I want to introduce you to the rest of the staff. There are nine of us, and they have worked super, super, super hard. Uh, so this is Masha, who is our secretary and our tour coordinator. For those of you who are going on the tour on Sunday, that is her brainchild. She's put it together. Uh, we also have Holland, who is our treasurer and our head of registration. Uh, and we have Sonia and Claudia and Ron, who are in charge of our events and social media. <laughs> We have uh, Hannah, who has crocheted anything that you see that's crocheted. <laughs> and we have that's Anna, who has. Hmm? Can we maybe tilt the webcam so that Diane can see? <laughs> <laughs> um, we have uh, Anna, who has been helping us out in myriad tiny little ways. <laughs> And Sarah, who is our guest liaison. Uh, OK, so um, I want to talk about rules and policies for a little bit, because it's opening ceremonies, and uh, damn it, we have to have rules. Um, <laughs> all of the rules are in the book. There are eight of them, I think. Um, so take a look. Um, read through it, please. The most important thing to read through is our spoiler policy, though. Um, we have a oh, weirdo in the room. <laughs> That's there not what I was going to say. But okay. uh, we have a guest of honor, and also I know a number of attendees who are not all of the way through, uh, who are not current with the series and the universe. So if you look in your schedule, you will see that some things are marked with a red diamond. Those are safe to talk about through Games Wizards Planet. 
Um, you could talk about anything that has happened in any of the short stories or the novellas or the books in any of the things that have a red diamond on them. Otherwise, uh, limiting discussion to high wizardry and before. So just the first three books, no short stories, no novellas or anything. And please take a look at the spoiler policy um, because there are some things that you might not think would be spoilers that are totally spoilers just because of the inflection of your voice. So be, be super careful. <laughs> um, if you are wondering, just, you know, like ask. Be like, hey, we're in a place where I'm not talking loudly and people can overhear us. What have you read? OK, cool. Let's talk about that thing. <laughs> Good question. Um, I'm running a little wizardry panel, and that is supposed to be spoiled friendly for everyone. Uh, so, net a mistake. Could be a mistake. All right. Could be a mistake. I'll add it to the list of mistakes that's later on in the thing. <laughs> <laughs> Um, you guys better send me a copy of this, because if I screw this up somehow, I'm going to be very embarrassed. We're sending asking, you so many things. Is she asking for the list of mistakes? <laughs> we, we, like, also, you know, we also... We also... We also have, um, in order to help affect uh, and promote the spoiler policy, a gift for Mark. What? <laughs> oh my God. to talk a little bit about uh, a number of you, many of you, are uh, wearing our color communication cards, uh, which is a super cool thing. There's more about them in the book. But essentially, they are a way for uh, you to indicate where you are on the spectrum from, you know what, I just kind of want to chill, chill by myself sitting here, to I would like to make friends, but I am shy to talk to people. So if you see somebody who is wearing green, like they want to make friends, go up and talk to them. Like that's totally cool. If you see somebody wearing yellow, only if you like have been introduced and they know your name, should you go up and talk. And if somebody is red, just let them chill because everybody experiences a convention in a different way and like they may just not be feeling it right then. So please, please respect those. Um, I have seen them work really well and I hope that they're gonna work really well here. Um, yeah. Quick suggestion about those. If you take all three and stick them in your name tag, if your name tag then gets flipped around, you'll be showing the opposite one from what you intended. So there's maybe a suggestion not to do that. Yeah, a lot of people have punched them twice and put them like here. It works pretty well. Yes, at registration. Great. Thank you. Yep. Uh, okay. <laughs> so, so we have a we have a few announcements. Uh, we have a few announcements just to make sure that everybody's on the same page. So uh, we have a couple of last minute corrections to the program book. Um, everything in the program book that says uh, Essex room is a lie. It should be Passaic room. That happened a couple of days ago. It's totally cool. The Essex room has like a pillar running through it and the Passaic room does not. The Passaic room is 
there. It is everything for the convention is on the left side of this hallway. So um, we uh, also uh, forgot to mark the little wizardry's panel as a spoiler OK zone. Um, we will have signs on the things for the doors um, that say, this is a spoiler-free zone, or this will have spoilers. So just check the door as you're walking in um, uh, to double check. And we'll uh, also <laughs> note it at the beginning of spoiler zone panels. Um, what? What? <laughs> oh, they're just the signs. Oh, that's OK. <laughs> um, Got it. Uh, we also were planning uh, to have uh, a reading by Diane, but instead she is going to talk about Star Trek for an hour. <laughs> 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 That's a lot of excitement there. Which we were the word gossip comes to mind. Yeah. <laughs> we were pretty sure you wouldn't be disappointed about that. Um, and yeah. there, there are a couple of things that some of the other members of our staff have uh, to tell you about. So Masha's going to say a couple of things about the tour. So a lot of you, a lot of you, have a badge that lets you go on the tour on Sunday. Um, when you signed in, at registration, you should have been told what group you are in. Um, and if you didn't, or if you didn't get your group number, or you don't remember your group number, you can go to registration and they will look it up for you. Um, I should be pointing this. <laughs> um, and for those of you on the tour, we will be leaving from the hotel lobby at 8 a.m. on Sunday. So be there before 8 a.m. on Sunday so you can meet your group leader, meet the rest of the group. We don't want anyone to get left. Um, the train station is a half mile from the hotel. It's a half mile and we will be walking. If you are concerned about making that walk, please come speak with me, okay? Yes? Uh, for folks that live in around New York City area, where should they meet up with you uh, on New York City? Um, why don't we uh, talk to Masha yeah, after the next ceremony? Yeah, why don't you come talk to me? Yeah, if you live in New York City, I'm also going to need to get your name so that we know you're not missing when we do head counts um, on Sunday morning. Yes? Uh, do you have a rough time of when the tour will be over? Um, our train out of Manhattan is at about is at about six. Um, yeah, so we should be back here by like six thirty, six forty-five. I don't know exact. I don't have exact travel time off the top of my head, but yeah, if you guys have any questions about the tour that you would like answered between now and the actual tour, I'm pretty easy to find. <laughs> Thank you. Cool. Uh, and um, we are a convention that was started because of social media, and we're a convention that, that will uh, continue to be through social media, and we want you all to be a part of that. And so to tell you how to do that, here is Claudia. Okay, so if you are on the internet, which I have a feeling some of you may be, <laughs> we would absolutely love you to share your experiences at the convention. Like 99% of our enjoyment is going to come from seeing your happiness. Um, so if you are on Tumblr, if you're on Twitter, if you're on Facebook, um, we have official blogs. You're welcome to send us stuff. Um, if you want to make your own post, use the tag CrossingsCon. There is no space. We don't like spaces. Um, we like money. space, but not space. <laughs> <laughs> um, there are some other tags that we have been using. If you are on Tumblr, you may have seen us use Overheard at the Crossings, OH at the Crossings. That, like, we're going to use it at the con. It's basically for out of context quotes mm -hmm. that you hear. Um, if you want to quote someone else, maybe ask them first, make sure they don't mind it. Um, if you want to, like, type them and then become friends and then, you know. But um, otherwise, we also have, we have Crossings Con After Dark. That is anything that happens after dinner. You seem excited. I'm glad about that. <laughs> um, so, you know, when things get weird and there might be some kind of strange things happening, then we, we really like that. 
Um, otherwise, there's also like on Tumblr, there's the die and gray hate noise. You can take, yeah, you can absolutely take pictures. A general thing, you're welcome to take pictures. If you take a picture of a human being, um, try to make sure they're okay with you posting it places. Some people do not want that, and that's totally cool. Um, if you are on a place that we are not on, I'm sure that those places exist, and you want to <laughs> post about stuff, that's totally cool. Um, we may not see it, because like we're mostly on the, the Tumblr, Twitter, Facebook. Um, we have an Instagram, I think. <laughs> if you are on Instagram, let me know, and then I'll, I'll check that out. But otherwise, I believe that's it. Oh, you maybe mentioned the not easy thing, right? Yes. Thank you so much for that. Um, so we also have, because you know our author is really cool and is actually online also, um, we have a tag, it's not UDD, again, no spaces, don't like spaces. Um, and it's basically for anything that is fan created. So if you have headcanons, if you wrote fanfic, um, we don't want the author to see that, we don't want her to get in legal hot water, just you know use that tag and then she won't see the thing. Masha, please. It's fan art okay? <laughs> fan art is okay, correct, Didi? Fan art, can we? Sorry? Um, a, a fan art, I, 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 if it gives, if it's plot heavy, I shouldn't see it. Okay. Okay. Really. From the other side. Like, yeah. um, <laughs> if you have any questions about whether something is okay or not, you can ask us. Um, you might be able to ask Didi. Uh, when in doubt, though, use the tag. She doesn't mind. She would rather, you know, not see something that might get her in trouble. So, um, yeah. Yeah. Are you done at all? You guys are happy. I'm happy. <laughs> so that is everything that I have written down, uh, mostly because I ran out of space on this piece of paper. <laughs> um, so the only thing that I, I have two things left to say. One of them is uh, if you have questions, or if you have troubles, or if you need somebody to help, Come find somebody. Uh, we'll all be wearing our staff shirts today. Many of us will be wearing our staff shirts tomorrow. All of us have staff on our badges. Um, come find one of us, somebody that you recognize from this group. And if we cannot help you, we will get you to the person who can help you. Um, the other thing, the only other thing that I have to say is go have fun. I'm so happy everybody is here. Welcome to Crossley Square! <laughs> so great. <laughs> so there's a little bit of a break, and then after this, uh, Mark will read uh, Theobroma for the very first time. Which I got like 20 minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs> that's uh, in here, right? That's in yeah. here. There is also a big thing, uh, like a family reunion, meet your cousins in the other room that's just a bunch of icebreakers, get to know people's names and stuff about them, um, and hang out with them. So until then, go mingle and have fun. <laughs> Yay. Oh, hey, Diane. You ought to see this. Thank you, Didi. This is. Oh, <laughs> that. This is Hannah's genius. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! You froze it. Oh, good. Okay. Cool. There we go. You're back. You're back. Fantastic. So, um, there we have opening ceremonies. Very exciting. My God. That, that, went, that went very well. Yeah. <laughs> um, oh, my God. <laughs> oh, I'm pretty sure this is the fabric of space waving at you right now. <laughs> we do have some people in cosplay, which is super, super cool. Yeah, we have a Carmela who actually has a laser dissociator, which is going on with the connection. Incredible. And here's the fabric of space. Um, and here's this is going to be Roshan uh, another day. Probably tomorrow. Yeah, pretty exciting. Okay. I have not seen others, but I'm sure they are here. They'll happen. They'll happen. They'll happen. Anyway, um, thank you so much for like 
being here and making this work, and I'm glad that we have now tested this, and it does work, indeed. <laughs> Hooray! It works fine. There are occasional hiccups and, yeah. you know, little problems with the latency, but I, I'd say offhand we're, we're doing quite well. Excellent. Um, Great to hear. So you need me again in at um, 1.30, yeah? Yes. Is that that's that's uh, still working for you? Congratulations. Uh, that's fine. Excellent. That's fine. No problem. Yeah, so we will um, see you then. <laughs> that's perfect. So now I can go put some whiskey in this water. Excellent. <laughs> we'll have we'll have a fantastic uh, we'll have a fantastic talk about Star Trek then. <laughs> Oh yeah, We're, we got some some very Absolutely. red bands hey, here. <laughs> little banjoing. Serious. I mean, this is a person with Riker it's on awesome. their name tag, yeah, so true. check this out. That's my uh, <laughs> convention. It, it does say like Riker. <laughs> All right, fantastic. So I think I have to go so to the next panel. You, I will call you at uh, sort of five minutes before. Okay. Um, we should be starting. Sounds great. And uh, we'll take it from there. Yeah. Sounds good. Hooray. That's <laughs> brilliant. So I'll see you in a little while. All right. Excellent. See you then. Thank you so much. Bye now. Bye.